This go-karter, in order to test how far a bullet could go, aimed his gun at the bus at the bottom of the hill. Susan on the bus was sound asleep when she was unfortunately hit. The husband on the sidelines heard the noise and looked closer, only to realize that his wife's shoulder was already red with blood. Richard yelled at the driver to stop the bus and the passengers on the bus panicked, thinking they were in a terrorist attack. Luckily there was no movement outside. Richard wanted to take his wife to the hospital, but the tour guide told him that the nearest hospital was a five-hour drive away. The bus had no choice but to turn around and drive to the nearest village. After a bumpy ride, they found the village barefoot doctor. Richard carried his wife in his arms, all the way to the village doctor's house. The village doctor told Richard that his wife's collarbone had been pierced, and she had to be operated on immediately or she would bleed to death. With that, he took out a blackened iron needle and sterilized it with a lighter. The wife looked at such a primitive tool, how refused to seek medical treatment, worried that she would be infected by bacteria. Richard was helpless upon hearing this, and in order for his wife to live, he could only ask the guy to hold her down. 